Assalamu alaikum, welcome to new tutorial. In this tutorial, I am going to model this part and crew parametric. So, before any the end video, if you are new on my channel, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel. Let's start at the part. But let's put an overview and the dimension. Uh, we have to draw the two circles of diameter 60 and 40. And the extrusion when you calculate, so it becomes 70. Let me open a new part, assign the proper name and say OK. This time I will extrude on front plane. I'm going to draw two circles, assign the dimension, this is 60, Why the other circle has a diameter of 40, and say OK, right? As I said you people, extrusion when you calculate, so it becomes 70, and this time I'm going to keep it as a midplane, say OK. To make these two flanges for that, I'm going to create planes just select this and at a distance of 15 as you can see from the drawing as well and say ok let me choose this plane make it normal extrude it and this time what I'm going to do is actually to draw a circle the radius is given in the drawing that is 10 so the diameter of this circle will become 20 and this time I'm going to draw a line from here tell here when it is tangent to this circle from here draw another line from here when it is going to tangent to it now train the unwanted portions this one this one now remove the unwanted constraints this constraint this constraint and put a point over here and over here dimension them from here till here this is 60 now select like this one make it tangent also this one make it tangent and say ok right just drag it in this direction and as you can see from here this is 15 and just confirm it right to create this second flange for that again I'm going to create a plane at distance of 15 and the width of this flange is 10 I'm going to choose this one and the distance of 15 ok select the plane extrude it and this time what I'm going to do is actually to draw a circle and it has a diameter of 10 and this distance is 60 ok let me draw a line from here tell here when it is going to tangent to that circle ok Again, trim the unwanted portions that you don't want it to be in your sketch. Trim the unwanted portions. This one, this one. Now, remove the unwanted constraints. Now. This one, make it tangent. This one, make it tangent. And say OK. Right? And this time what I should do, I'm going to, this is 10. This word is 10. And just say OK. Right? Okay. Now this time what I'm going to do is actually to create these cutouts. For that I'm going to extrude on this plane circle. And as you can see from here, the diameter is 10. For that 
Let me take the reference of this circle. Draw a circle of diameter of 10. Confirm it. Just flip the direction and remove material. To create the second hole on this face, let me take the reference of this circle. Close it for now. Circle. Ten. Sorry. I have done a mistake over here in the second flange. Let me cancel it for now. Just dimension it. And this is 20. And just confirm it. Right? I'm going to extrude on this plane. Just take the reference of this circle. Draw a circle over here and take the diameter is 10. Say OK. Just flip the direction and as you can see remove material is by default selected. So the part is done. Let me assign some color, view, appearance and this time what I'm going to come down or select the part and say OK. So the part is done. Hopefully you like this video. If you are new on my channel, so please don't forget to subscribe. You can check the, uh, as you can see, the cross section of the part as well. Yes. Now uh, let me open the planes section, plane, and let me choose this plane. Right. So you can do either by any of the way. So thanks for watching.